Uh, August. Yeah. <laughs> Are you still reading Regis's book? I am. I am. Read... <laughs> yeah. I am. Uh, Re Regis, Regis was here July, uh, July 22nd. July 22nd, great show. That was a great That was night. a good show. Uh, great night. But this, this, this one will be good too. <laughs> oh, it'll be fine. Come on back after these messages for these excellent products. Show with Craig Ferguson, sponsored by Zentac. No pill relieves heartburn faster. Ladies and gentlemen, Craig Ferguson. It's starting to sound a little bit sarcastic. A little bit, a little bit. Very, very, what a crowd, Jeff. Oh, so much. It better. reminds me of that crowd we had in July 22nd. Yeah. Remember those guys? Yeah. Those guys were crazy. They were nuts. They were I know, and remember after that show, we all got naked? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we all got, I think I caught something that night, but it was totally worth it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a great day for America, everybody. <laughs> It's a very hot. It's very hot out there. Yeah, it looks hot. It looks. It looks bomb. It looks like it might be a thunderstorm threatening. <laughs> Do you get frightened of thunderstorms? Do you hide somewhere? All of you are just the front bit. <laughs> just the front. Anyway, if you don't know about me, you know this is the day I look forward to all year. Oh, yes, August 7th. Because <laughs> it's National Lighthouse Day, according... Yeah, yeah according yeah. to the internet. I consulted it today. I used uh, the CBS computer. You know? Yeah. It's, you turn it on. You know how, like, you know, some computers are turned on, it goes... Oh, like that, that. Yeah, right. Do that noise the computer oh, makes. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. The CBS computer, you turn it on, it goes like this. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> <laughs> and then you have to put in a big floppy disk, and then sometimes you get the internet. And I found out this, um, that the, uh, it's National Lighthouse Day today. Yes, that's right. Yes, you said that, yes. <laughs> oh, did I say that? Yeah, just you're making sure everyone knows. Very right, good. right. Yes. I'm, I'm saying it again in case, because uh, we're live and it we're can live. get edited. Right. <laughs> anyway, uh, National Lighthouse Day. A lighthouse, of course, a symbol of safety and security. And, and also another type of symbol, Jeff. What type of symbol? Phallic. Phallic symbol. <laughs> like a giant big thing right there telling you to stay away or come close. Your option. <laughs> I like to think of this show as a, a lighthouse. You know, a beacon of hope drawing in wayward insomniacs seeking safe harbor only to be dashed to pieces on the rocks of disappointment. <laughs> Very touching, Craig. It's very moving. Well, you know me, the heat gets me emotional. Yeah, it's very hot. Yes, I understand. Probably. 
You know, the scientists are saying that the average person's ability to detect smells begins to fade after the age of 40. However, after the age of 40, the ability to create smells <laughs> is just beginning to kick in. <laughs> I speak from... So I'm like, I smell things now. I'm like, no way that's from me. Yeah, man. I'm like, hey, hey. <laughs> oh, oh, did you just turn on the computer? Yes, I did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very excited. There's a big movie opening uh, midnight tonight, uh, you know, between August 7th and August 8th. Right, that's right, yeah. Uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movies. It's, you know, it's the, an intimate character-driven story filled with subtext and allegory. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's got Megan Fox in it. It's got turtles and stuff. Get blown up. I'm in. Anyway, that's oh, I'm yeah. going. Gotta see it. <laughs> if you're not familiar with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, they're turtles who fight crime and help people. Not only that, they're teenagers. Now, in real life, of course, teenagers are surly little bastards who do not help people. <laughs> <laughs> the movie may not be accurate, is what I'm saying. In real life, also, turtles are mellow, deliberate, even-tempered. They are the Animal Kingdom's Canadians. <laughs> <laughs> I look forward to your reasonably thought-out letters. <laughs> Turtles can't fight crime, of course, unless, you know, crime can be stopped with salmonella. I, you know what I found on the internet today about turtles? Because I was Googling it today because it's so hot to I right. go outside. And <laughs> this is absolutely true. Some turtles, I was delighted to see this, can breathe through their anus. <laughs> I know. You're like, oh, what a lovely day. <sighs> <sighs> it doesn't impress me, though I live in Hollywood. People in here may not breathe through their anuses, but they talk out of them all day long. <laughs> There you go, that's true. All right, I can't, I can't go on, Jeff. I need a commercial break. It's too hot. <laughs> <coughs> are you turning off or on the computer, or what are you doing? No, I was coughing out of my anus. <laughs> well, um, uh, gesundheit? Thank you. You said thank you without all your oh, speaking. Yeah. <laughs> So, you said thank you there, but your mouth didn't move. Was that you speaking out of your anus? That's correct. <laughs> hey, Jeff, let's see if I can speak out of my anus in the style of Morgan Freeman. Okay, all right. Well, we're going to have a crappy show, everybody. Come back with us in just a moment, and we'll have more crap for you. Did that ball go in there at the goal and then it did? The ball went in and it bounced off the tree. Oh, hell. Or it seemed to more accurately bounce off the air near the tree. Near the tree. <laughs> what time is it, Jeffrey Pearson? It's tweet mail time. Time to take advice from a man who's wearing his favorite July tie in August. <laughs> Play the jingle, would you? Chicken Vindaloo is good to eat. My name is Scooter. I'll fix your computer. I'm a happening guy and a dope troubleshooter. When you go take support, you'll be talking to me. I got more patience than Mahatma Gandhi. And email. Hey. Ah. All right, this is from uh, Timothy in Providence, Rhode Island. You ever been there? Oh, yeah, Timothy. <laughs> Says, Craig, are you taping any shows in advance this summer like you did last summer, or are you live? Live all summer, oh, Timothy. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell because of the local news story we will insert later. Yeah, that was shocking, that one thing that happened to that guy. 
Well, the good thing is, it wasn't a downer. <laughs> it wasn't a downer. No, we won't choose a story that's a downer. We'll choose a story like, you know, a, a pigeon that can read or something. Right, I understand. Or a... I, don't know why I, do I don't know why you're doing that. Uh, no, well, you know, it's the heat. Uh, <laughs> this is from uh, Rina and Kazuno in Japan. Japan? Japan, you say? Yes! You know the show goes out in Japan now. It does, yeah. Yeah, yeah. we've been going out and it's proving very popular. <laughs> uh, Rina says, Craig, your Japanese fan club is growing. Because then she puts in brackets, I'm having a baby. You see? I see, yeah. That's how potent this show is. <laughs> Ladies, get closer to the strain. Come on, a little closer. Mm. Okay, I'd go and get a test. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> So, uh, when I pass gas now, it makes a ting noise. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I've been working on my buns. <laughs> yeah. That's, what that's about you? Thing, that's that thing where you talk out of your, your anus. Is that the, is yeah, that is the that show? Yeah, is that today or was that... Or was that... <laughs> that that's, that's today. today. That's yeah, 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 that's yeah, today. That's yeah, that's right. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> uh, this is from Kristen and New Paltz in New York. You ever been there? New, po New Paltz? Yeah, yeah. What's your favorite Paltz? New Paltz or just regular? I like the older Paltz. Older Paltz? <laughs> she says, Craig, my friends and I were wondering, how many times a week do you have sex? <laughs> There's not a lot to do in New Paltz, is there? No. <laughs> well, uh, it depends. You know, someone else there or just me on my own? Because there's two... <laughs> Because I can really rack up some numbers if, uh... <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I mean, hey, you know what? Come here, come here. Get a little closer to the screen. <laughs> Just had it again. <laughs> and that's your late-night TV baby boom right there. <laughs> Bam. This is from uh, Brianna in Sarasota, Florida. Have you ever been there? I Jeff? love Sarasota. Oh, so do I. You know what I like about Sarasota? Well, you go first. Oh, I like the, the water. Yeah. <laughs> and I like the oranges. Oh, the oranges. Oh, the oranges. Oh, yeah. They're not the only fruit, though, Jeff. No, they're not. <laughs> You're welcome, lesbians. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, <laughs> Brianna says, Craig, some of us really like the Kardashians and we would like you to please leave them alone. Well, some of you can go Crikey. f*** yourself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think the people have spoken. This is from David in Phoenix, Arizona. You ever been there? Oh, God, I love it. It's that. hot there. It's almost as hot as it is it's here. A, it's a much, much hotter. Much hotter. Uh, David says, Craig, I know I'm late to the party, but I just watched Ghost Rider, and it was awesome. Oh, it is. It is awesome, isn't it, oh, what a what a film. Uh, a skeleton on a, on a motorbike, but the skeleton is on fire, and Nicolas Cage is the person that turns into the skeleton. What's that coming to go? Al-Qaeda. <laughs> <laughs> Nicholas Cage, a skeleton Cage. on fire on a yeah. chopper. Nicholas Cage, Nicholas a skeleton Cage. on fire and a chopper. Look at me, I'm a skeleton. <laughs> I didn't know you did Nicholas I turned Cage. into a skeleton. <laughs> that's great. Yeah, that's is, my is there such Nicholas a thing Cage. as a Nicholas Cage fly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm flying. I'm flying here. Oh, I'm not. Oh. You can't stop me! Oh, oh. <laughs> Nicholas Cage fly? What the hell? <clears throat> uh, this, is, uh, this is from Alice in uh, Rockville, Maryland. We like Maryland. What, what did I get in Maryland? Uh, crabs. Crabs, yeah. <laughs> Says, Craig, I, I'm going to Philadelphia. So where is that cheesesteak place run by Serge? Oh, yeah, there's that guy Serge. He doesn't sound like a cheesesteak guy in Philly, but he runs a... Ch he does, yeah. He, he, maybe, oh. Oh, oh, my gosh. Maybe, maybe that's him. Hello? Hello, Craig. It's Serge. Oh, hi, Serge. Serge from Philadelphia that runs the cheesesteak place? Yeah, of course. It's me. How are you? I'm great, man. We were just
was just talking about you, how you don't sound like uh, the other guys that have cheesesteak places in Philly. Yeah, no, well, I emigrated and I live on the Upper West Side, uh, literally. <laughs> but yeah, you look great. I love your, oh, you got your tie, you got your, your, your uh, July tie. Yeah, I have got, I sometimes wear my July tie in August and sometimes that's okay. <laughs> I'm sorry for looking over Sarah, there. Who are you talking to? You no, talking I, I, to I'm talking to Serge. Oh, Serge, sorry. Yeah, sorry. yeah. I'm sorry. It's funny how you and Serge never talk at the same time. No, no, we could. I mean, if you oh, want. Oh, you could? Yeah. Hi, uh, Serge. Hi, yeah, how are you? I'm all right. How are you doing? I'm you want to talk to Jeff? Yeah, sure, yeah. Okay. Yeah, hi, Jeff. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm a great guy. Oh, here we go. Hi, <laughs> how are you? That's great. I'm good. <laughs> Click. Some... <laughs> Sometimes I think you're just showing off. Why are you talking to me, man? You're talking to Serge. You told me and Serge to talk to each other, so we talk to each other. What's your problem? <laughs> and finally, this is from Caroline in St. Paul, Minnesota. You ever been there? You know it. Have you ever been there? Oh, you know it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Inside of an ostrich? <laughs> That's, that's what you're asking me. Hey, hey, you know what? That's what you're... Hey, you know what? An ostrich, an ostrich, an ostrich. <laughs> yeah. ostrich an ostrich can run at speeds of up to 65 miles an hour. But that's not fast enough, is it, Jeff? No, it's not. <laughs> We're going to make one that'll go faster, Craig. I'm so sorry to everyone who likes ostriches. <laughs> it's stupid. We're just being stupid. We don't mean any harm by it, all right? Come yeah, crikey. Down. It's fine. All right. <laughs> all right, and finally, this is from Caroline in St. Paul, Minnesota. It says, Craig, how come you always seem to have Canadians in your audience? Because I like them. <laughs> they like me, and they know this is a friendly place where they won't be judged for their politeness and their civilized behavior. <laughs> right, Jeff? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, the tickets are free and Canadians are cheap. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back. Franklin and Bash, the new season premiere August the 13th, just six days from now, on, uh, yep, uh, on, uh, on the TNT network. Take a look at this. Frank and Meyer, everybody, Frank and Meyer. Your, ar your arm grew back then. Yeah, my that arm looks, came back. That looks awesome. It was fun. The zombie was super fun. action. What? That's it, it, exactly what you want in a law show. Yes, it is. Limbs being, limbs being ripped off. Well, you see, I think Law and Order needs that now. That's do, what's do, missing do, from do, it. Do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah. 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 Be good. Be good. Uh, Converse yeah. high tops, never out of fashion. Yep. Nope. Always. Never yeah. out of fashion. Never out of fashion. Never through disco, through nope. punk, through you know the flower power six. Glam. Yeah. Everything. And you can always do that. My three sons. Which I do in a regular the movie theater. That's nice. Yeah. I love it. I've got. Hey, I'm sorry for putting my feet on your desk. Oh, no, hey, man, relax. You okay. can have this desk if you want. I'm really? leaving soon. Let's go. <laughs> All right. What will you do with it? Why are you going? Uh, well, I've had a better offer. Okay. Dig it. Wait a minute. You're full of balloon juice. You're oh, a liar. Hey, hey You're that's not liar. the kind of talk we want around here in our sailor. <laughs> balloon juice. That's Why not... I ought to you call understand. the censor. We can drink together? Yeah, go on then. Cheers. How are you doing? I'm well. Yeah, yeah. Give me one second, because I can't talk and drink. Oh, OK. <laughs> I can, on the other hand. Watch this. I can talk uh, 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 in the sound, in the voice of Morgan Freeman while I'm drinking. Please. OK. Well, that's a fine bit of water right there. <laughs> Wow. It's going down my throat nice and cool. <laughs> ah, that hits the spot. <laughs> How about that? I wish Put you... Put that in your uh, zombie courtroom drama. I would love that. I would love that guy to narrate my life. 
Just what, Morgan Freeman? Yeah. He's awesome. You know when he's he comes so cool. Have you met him? No. Oh, he's awesome. I'm, 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 I'm TV. I'm that kid in Clueless. I'm not me, Morgan Freeman. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, you'd meet Morgan Freeman. He'd love you, man. He'd be like, yeah, I got nothing more to talk to you about at all. But no, no, no. no. <laughs> he, he's... My Morgan Freeman impression real quick. No, no, put that no. together. I mean, yeah. I, I know at least one person here who's delighted to hear your Morgan Freeman <laughs> impersonation. But look, the... Um, the, you know, he's not like that. He's cool. He's is, have, you had him, is he, have you had him on the show? Monday, all the time. Really? Yeah, a few oh, times a year. I can't tell if you're lying. No, I'm not lying. Okay, all right. That's the thing about my accent. The way really? it sounds like a lie, and it's dirty. You're from Texas, yeah. right? <laughs> you know, you know, it like, sounds like it's from Texas, right? Tex I'm, I'm good with Texas. dialects. Yeah. Where are you from? L.A., uh, pretty much. I was born in Minnesota, uh, and I lived in Texas for a bit. Really? What yeah. part of Texas? Houston. Mm. Yeah. It gets very humid to death. It there. really humid. It was the first time ever where I was only called by my last name. I'd never heard that as a kid. I was just like, Meyer, get over here. And I, Meyer, get over here. I was like, you can, call me, you can call me Bragging before you punch me. That'd be yeah. cool. Yeah. So, yeah, you don't want to be on a first name basis with someone that's going to slap you around a bit. Well, I guess you do. It depends do you. on what it is. As long, yeah, 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 I was about to say, no, it, it went, could go well. There, no, I'm yeah. just saying, if you have a safe word, it could be awesome. <laughs> is that not what you meant? Well, is that, is that you, not where well, you were going? No, but I'm happy to go there. Do okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm curious. Do you yeah. enjoy the sadomasochism there? Yeah. <laughs> Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I have issues with my dad and my smother, and I oh, feel Oh, that, oh, oh, right there. What? You made the Freudian penis. What do you oh, think? Wait, I did it, too. I did it, too. This is awful. <laughs> uh, <laughs> are you in therapy? No. Oh, you should Should be. I be? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I like it. I like okay. it a lot. Too. Are you in therapy? Yeah, yeah. Often? Yeah, yeah. Once a week, I'm there really? talking about myself for an hour. Does he have a pipe? Yeah, no, I think the pipe adds the air of gravitas that I'm looking for. In a Super therapy. gravitas right here, by the way. I feel like you feel like I, I feel can like help you. Yeah. Well, come on, help me with your problems then. What do you feel okay. insecure about? I just, I don't know. I mean, I guess Franklin and Bash, this is, you know, we're coming on soon. I'm hoping it does well. Oh, come on, you it'll know? do fine. But why are you, you basing think? your self esteem on how you do in show business? Groggy! Show business, man. Yeah, yeah. you get it. You guys, this is my brother's more successful than me, and he's doing well. Uh, really? What, what's your brother? No, I'm so much yeah. more successful. Are you kidding? No, I got you kidding? I'm here. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. 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 You know who's not here? My brother. Yeah. 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 Ay, caramba. Frank, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Can he say that? I probably well, can't the say that. A lot. Let him uh, a curse word on the One end. curse word. I've never what? cursed on no. What's wrong with <laughs> All right. You know, sometimes... What if that's his name? <laughs> what if... The, what? <laughs> that is his name. That would... That, that he's, guy... he's Welsh. <laughs> <laughs> that's his name. <laughs> You ever been to Wales? I have never. That's a real name there. Is that, yeah. is that right? <laughs> well, kind of. The Welsh, you know how the Irish and the Scots have got a reputation for drinking? Heard of that? Yeah, well, the Welsh, man. That's Like nobody's business? That's who drink. Like, you go to, as a Scottish alcoholic, which I am, you go, to, uh, you go to Wales in the middle, in the height of your cups. I went there, they're like, that guy doesn't drink very much. <laughs> <laughs> they drink a lot. Wow. Yeah, yeah, they're crazy. Should we go when you're uh, done with this whole gig? You and me? A little trip? No, man. I'm kind of like not doing that anymore. Well, you can be, I'm, can I be guard my sober now. buddy. But you can carry, I'll be carry your me sober home. buddy? Yeah, well, I work home. for you? What, am I a clown or you something? You need a job. <laughs> well, I, I don't know if I need a job. I'm going to go, I'm going to walk the air. No, I'm going to walk the air. Like Kane from Kung yeah, Fu? Yeah, Kane and Kung Fu. Okay. Like, you know, Sam Jackson at the end of Pulp Fiction. I'm yeah. going to walk the earth. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to go from town to town, solve you a frame or two. You know what he needed? You know what Sam Jackson needed was a Vincent Vega. Maybe that's what... My gig can be. Yeah, but Vincent Vega gets... Maybe we walk yeah, together. He, he gets killed in the movie. Spoiler alert. <laughs> maybe it's they, a 20-year-old movie! Oh? So? Maybe they haven't seen it. Well, we have to take a commercial break. I'll, can I stay? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Yeah, what? Say, what? We were just talking about just crack. Give, give us a second. Yeah. <laughs> I, no, lo you... I love crack. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we back? Okay, yeah. yeah. Sorry. What we're talking about is that, uh, because you've started playing golf. I've started playing golf. And I only started like 18 months ago, two years ago. No, less than that. 
Really? Less than a Are year. you really bad at it? Terrible. Yeah, me Although, too. Thank goodness. This, yeah. will, this will bother you. I what? have a hole in one. You got a hole in one? Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Don't, don't applaud. I don't know if it's true. <laughs> it's true. I can tell you the hole that happened. It, right, right. It was right. 203. It was at Rancho. It was very exciting. You got a hole in I one? I got a hole in one. I had the Hell? trophy and everything and all They that. gave you a trophy? Yeah, they, well, I, I got a trophy made. I got the ball and the certificate. <laughs> <coughs> so. So you went up to Hollywood. Give you a trophy. Like, I, I can get a trophy. Yeah. Jeez, man. I went and bought a trophy. A whole one? Yeah. It was crazy. That's amazing. But it is super crazy addictive. Very addictive. By the way, it helps to have, like, either a Bagger Vance type voice or the Morgan Freeman voice when you're playing. If you put it in your head, it actually ties it pretty well together. Really? I never even thought yeah. of that. Yeah. Well, maybe I could do that in my head the next time, because I'm very bad at it. I, yeah. I have a Rodney Dangerfield voice in my head. That's going to help. No, you, know. you want that, like... Well, it's Caddyshack, man. No, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely good. That's fun. I'll take one of these. Yeah, yeah. come on. It's, uh, it's super addictive. It's, yeah, I know. It's, it's crazy. To, and I'm not good at all. Doesn't matter. But, Doesn't yeah. matter. I don't have to be good at it. It's no. the whole point is play the game, isn't it? Yeah, I you guess. Know, I, is the only thing I worry about a little bit is that, you know, the, the clothing. Yeah, not a, not a big fan. Of the I, bright bright colors and all that, you go. Yeah, do you wear the little hat with the ball on the top? Yeah, I do. But yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I, you know, the, it's the shorts and the, yeah. you know, and the, and then the, sitting in the little thing, the little cart. I don't like right. the carts. Why? Well, because I like to walk. Well, you can walk. They they. No, you. they don't let you walk. You're at fancy places. Though. No, no, not fancy places. Really? Yeah, yeah. The fancy places you have to walk, and then okay. you have to walk next to a guy. And you get five hundred bucks to get, right? yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It's all. Yep. No, it's I'm, I'm bad with the clothes thing because because I'm like built like a small Haitian boy and so when yeah. I when I buy what <laughs> um, so, you guys are yeah. racist <laughs> but, um, <laughs> but they're t they tend to be kind of baggy things which is where I get uncomfortable because I feel like I look like I well you can wear out a my converse high tops some you know, I can't I've tried really you can't play yeah and these are really slippery on the bottom yeah, not, yeah. Not, not that there's nothing wrong with converse but um, <laughs> You know, I'll take a piece of that converse. sweet, sweet, huh? free Converse yeah. action. Yeah. Yeah. Converse, yeah. What, oh, they're great. They That's the America's shoe, man. Yeah, their slogan. Well, Nike's just do it. was Converse. Yeah, yeah. Like, come on, just wear it. But converse yeah. are like, we don't need to advertise. Ooh la la. Yeah. yeah. That's the slogan. <laughs> That's Converse's slogan. Yeah. Which we can't say well, unless we're talking about my brother's <laughs> birthright name. Right? Yeah, we're out of time. Okay. All right. So, Sweet. Uh, so, uh, you want an awkward pause or a little bit of meditation, maybe? Or what do you want? I like uh, meditation. Go with that. Yeah. Can I just take a moment? Just uh, you know, let your chakras open up. <laughs> Wonderful actress, very good friend of this show, very, very beautiful, very, 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 very beautiful. She smells wonderful, too. <laughs> My ability to smell things has uh, decreased somewhat since. <laughs> Is that this show? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's this show, yeah. 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 <laughs> But my ability to make smells. Oh yeah. Oh, it's it's astonishing. <laughs> Please welcome the vision that is Marina Baccarin, everybody. Marina Baccarin.
Look at you. Look at you, woman. You look sensational. Oh, just stop. amazing. Just stop. All right, all right, come on. No, no, you do look good. I tell you, uh, just be before we get started, I just wanted to say, uh, Brecken's introduced a new thing about when you finish the conversation, <laughs> you get up on the desk and... Uh... He totally screwed me. <laughs> I was going to do that anyway. Well, a week and cut has been out, even although this is a live show. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm doing great. Good. Have you recovered? Because I know you're Brazilian and there was the World Cup and all that. We're not going to talk about that. Oh, really? Oh, okay. We're not going to talk about that because I'm going to cry. Do you want to see me cry? No, I do not want to see you cry. Seriously, how are we ever going to live this down? I think, actually, uh, Brazil will rise from this and it'll actually be a good thing for them in the end. It will stop... Really? Yes, you know, a little bit of uh, humble pie. There'll be a g better team than... I have no idea what they're no going to do. No humble yeah. pie. We should have won. It was on our well, soil. Well, I, I don't know. I mean, I, when you get beat, you know, by over six goals in one match, <laughs> you know, at that I point, know. it's kind of like, it's not a lucky win. You know, it's like, <laughs> you weren't robbed. You I know? know, I know. The joke in my household as we were watching was like, well, I gotta go to the bathroom. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna miss another goal from Germany. I should wait. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, do you follow the soccer or are you just... Well, really? I do a little bit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, mostly the World Cup, but... Um, I follow some Brazilian soccer. See, but I think that most Americans, because you're kind of an American now, right? Yeah. Right, right, right. Yeah, so yeah. I think most Americans, soccer's like swimming. You know, like, for four years, you don't care about it, and then you're like, oh, I USA, love it. swim like crazy! Yeah, and then, like, yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm going to watch <laughs> swimming on TV? I actually love both, because I'm a swimmer. Oh, are you really? Yeah, so I do two things that, you know, people don't care about. No, I, 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 I'd watch you swim. <laughs> Do you, you want to show us any of your swimming moves? On what? your desk? Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, imagine this. No, hey, uh, Easy. Wait, excuse me a second. A dream on. <laughs> Please. So is that how you, is that your keep fit? Is that your secret yeah. for your swimming? I do, I swim, I love it. It's really? very meditative, you know? Yeah, well, I, I swim for, I get bored swimming. Do you? Yeah, unless there's a shark or something. <laughs> you ever Thanks. done that? You ever swum with sharks? Actually, I have in Australia. Oh. Look at that. You never know what you're going to find out about me. I'm interested. Hold on. <laughs> OK, so <laughs> why were you swimming? Was it by accident? Did a shark come up? or did No, you no, go... no. I was um, in the Great Barrier Reef. Right. And you go sco not scuba diving, uh, snorkeling, as one does. Right. And uh, there were reef sharks around. And we. And... Oh, reef sharks. Come on. <laughs> they're the... sharks. They're angel face. The reef shark. <laughs> A reef shark? Why, if there was a reef shark here now, he would ask me if I knew where there was a store. There... <laughs> the reef shark is the pointless shark. You okay, would... why would I swim with real sharks? Uh, you, well, you make a fair point, but they, uh... <laughs> well, because they're, you know, they're exciting, interesting, amazing animals. Very frightening, though. Yeah, yeah, I'd rather just see them in a zoo or something, an aquarium, you know? Well, right, yeah, fair enough. What do you do? There? What kind of animals do you like? Do you like horse riding, kangaroos, any of those things, dingoes? Uh, I was... <laughs> dingoes. No, they still babies. I oh, but you got a baby. You got to stay away from the dingoes. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> what is it? What age is your baby now? He's nine months today. Oh, congratulations. It's his birthday. Uh, nine months today, August the 7th? Yeah, oh. But, yeah. So, he... Nine months today, August the August 7th? August 7th, yeah. 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 Or is he... <laughs> Why, well, it sounds to me... He's old for his age, so he looks like ten months for his age, right? <laughs> It does. Yeah. Like nine and a half, yeah. That's yeah. good. Are you, and everyone going okay? You get sleep? Everything's great. We, yeah. uh, no, no, there's no sleeping happening no, in the No, never again, actually. No, no, but he just braved two months in Morocco, actually. We, I was shooting a film there. Morocco? How was that? Yeah. With a baby? Um, not great. <laughs> I'm going to say not great. Right. It was hot. It was really hot. As it was hot really as it dusty. is here today, probably? Hotter. No Whatever way. Whatever it is here, it's... To, uh, on August 7th, right. it is hotter in Morocco. I, I've, been, I've been to Morocco. It, I liked it a lot, but I don't know if I would take a, a young star. I know, there. in retrospect, yeah. probably not the wisest yeah. choice. But, but you know, it was, um, it was a good experience for him. What part of Morocco were you in? Uh, it was in a city called Warzazat, which is in the middle of the... De well, not the middle, it's sort of the mouth of the Sahara, you know. Ooh, it's, wow. Yeah, it was really dusty. Uh, yeah, very dusty. Kind of Dry and, uh, and um, yeah. we were doing a biblical, a biblical epic called really? Red Tent. Which, I read that book. Yes, yeah, yeah, Red Tent. Yeah, it's a chick book. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, uh, <laughs> know your enemy. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh. <laughs> really? No, I read it. 
I read it a while back. Uh, I can't re remind me. It's about uh, lady. Vaginas. Yeah, well, vaginas, yeah. yes, but the. Uh, <laughs> But it's about the... It's, it's a, the a retelling. Pro, a pro, it's a... No, it's the retelling of the Jacob, Rachel, Dina story. It's the, you know, the red tent is where the women go to, like, menstruate and give birth. You know, right, right, stuff. right, right. Um, and it, it involves all the wives, Jacob's wives. Oh, well, yeah, that's know, I remember all that now, yeah. All that stuff. I didn't get all the way through it. <laughs> <laughs> the truth comes yeah, out. No, I remember reading it now, because I thought it was about a brothel, and then I'm like, oh, no, it's not. <laughs> Almost. I felt like I was in a brothel. I didn't really think it through when I took the job. I played a midwife, and it meant that I was going to be elbow deep in vaginas the entire time I was shooting. I'm listening. <laughs> Seriously, I showed up to work one day, and nobody bothered to warn me that um, I, somebody was giving birth, and she was actually, actually going to be naked. Well, uh, well, it was an actress pretending. But she was at, like, she took off her underwear, and I was kneeling, and she was standing. Slower, slower. <laughs> my, and the camera was behind her, and my face was in her. Yeah, well, this is the greatest movie I've ever heard of. It was scary. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. The first time you see one, they're pretty frightening, <laughs> but but soon you learn to love them. <laughs> I don't want to learn to love them. Well, I don't know. <laughs> Keep an open mind, for God's sakes. Uh, yeah. No, so... <laughs> When's that coming out, then? <laughs> um, I don't know. End of the year. All right. Well, that's... Uh, I'll, yeah. I'll be looking for a gig yeah. run about then, so... Uh, so I'll, I'll maybe, uh, you know, help you with it. Okay. I, that's what I'll do. I'll go and do promotional work for a movie I've got no part of. <laughs> You can maybe be one of the babies. Uh, no, that doesn't work. It doesn't work out. No. I did look like a baby once. <laughs> a yeah. long time ago. <laughs> once I shaved my entire body in Winnipeg and I looked like a baby. Too, was, too much, I think. I was probably. bored. I was bored. I bet you were a cute baby. Nah, apparently not. <laughs> fat little whiner, they say. <laughs> Aren't all babies fat? No, they cry all the time. Or maybe just my baby. <laughs> <laughs> Is your baby a crier? No, no, actually, he's not. He's really good-natured. We've yeah. put him through a lot, and he's, he's a truck. He just, like, trucks on. That's great. No, I, I, yeah. I feel for you, though, with uh, nine, ten months old. Oh, God. Yeah, no, yeah. there's no sleeping. I, what do I do to make him sleep? Uh, nothing legal. Yeah. <laughs> did you do the whole sleep training thing? Yeah, yeah, I did, actually. Yeah, yeah? yeah a couple of times. Yeah, it's, it's all right. Yeah. It's all right. It's tough, you know. But it'll train you for how much pain you're going to be emotionally for the rest of your life. True. And him, yeah. Well, no. He, you think it over it, right? Yeah, they'll be fine. You yeah. Know, it's, you're, you're the one that's going to be worried until you're old and then die. You know. <laughs> this has been really uplifting. Thank yeah, you. That's, that's being a parent. You know, yeah. you just, you'll never sleep with both eyes closed ever again. Right. I won't. I'll always forever worry about him. Yeah. And yet, it's awesome. Yeah. I know. It's the greatest love ever. I know. It's the craziest. Uh-oh. Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> ah, well, good times. Uh, well, we're out of time. You do look amazing, though. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Marina Baggett, right, everybody. We're right back. We hope you've enjoyed the show this evening, and we'd like to leave you with a song that uh, is something we don't have to pay for. It's called Warm Towel. <laughs> oh, the warm towel of winter. Jeff. This is your big moment. <laughs> if you haven't realized by now, we're working on limited resources here. <laughs> <laughs>